And there should be some water on the other side. And when we get back home, it's going to be story time. All right. Unless do you want me to tell the story on the way. That's a yes. All right. Okay. I'll stick close to me. Okay. So I can tell the story without, without you getting hurt. All right. So you remember Technoblades? You remember the Technoblade stories I told you about the potato war? Well, this one is a bit different. This story is not going to be part three of the potato war. This story is about him and me taking over the world. So we used to play together in a different world. Different than this. It was a lot more simple. We had guns, but it was a little bit more simple. There was less, less things to kill you, you know? It's just other people, really. It's other people. And one day, Techno mentions to me, Hey, I know how to take over the world. I know how we can just take everyone's stuff. And it'll be really funny. So I get to work. I spend hours and hours and hours grinding. Making sure we have everything we need. I stay up until 4am almost every day leading up to it. So when we do try to take over the world, we're fully prepared. We have god apples. We have emeralds. We have everything. And he tells me all we need to do is just drive our boats around this specific spot. And I was like, I don't believe it. I don't believe it's going to be that simple. That's crazy. You know what? It was that simple. That's how good he was. That's how smart he was. That's how far ahead he planned. He knew exactly how long it would take, how much power it would take, and he calculated it. And we did it. We took over the world that day. We kind of pissed off a few people, but all in good fun. It was mostly cosmetic anyway. We just wanted to prove we could do it. And from that moment on, everyone feared feared the name Antarctic Empire. It was synonymous with battle, with preparation, and with friendship. So if you ever hear anyone utter the words Antarctic Empire, you can tell them your dad was part of that. Your dad helped Techno take over the world. Yeah. I see a lot of them in you, actually. I, I do see a lot of them in you. I reckon one day you'll take over the world. I'll be right there watching. <laughs>